I'm hoping the other video I send goes through and everything, but I think you might want to use this one because I'm more alive in this because it's basically me because I'm trying to tell you guys here that I'm single, I'm going to be 36 years old, I celebrate my birthday on Halloween even though I'm born on November 1st, I cosplay, I crochet, I make stuff, I mean I have a very nice collection, but I wish I could take it out to show you guys, but my only camera that really works is on this. I, being a geek does affect dating because you got these guys that want the submissive girl, the girl that's not independent, the girl who does, who speaks like, yeah, sir, uh, or, oh, look at my beautiful manicure, or look at this, oh, just ignore that, okay, um, you know, as you can see, here's my beautiful manicure, this is what happens when you, cro it, it, this might be crocheting, my fingers are cracked open, you see, look, no beautiful nails, no nothing, right, no makeup on here, that's what I'm saying, guys, if you can edit this all, like, fix this, okay, you caught me at a bad time, I'm showing you the real me, okay, this might even be changed too by the time I get to Comic Con because I need to trim it out and put a bang because I love my bang, but it's not a real. It's like a bang that would be nice. Problem and fix my highlights because as you can see, my hair is turning green because I'm a dark blonde and I have to put highlights in because I have low and medium highlights. I don't have highlights. Okay, so I don't know what else to say. I'm named after the Rescue Ranger Mouse Gadget. That's how I got my nickname. I wear my cat ears because. I'm surprised you haven't caught on with my first name because I grew up on the Captain America comic 1976, the year I was born, is um, Felicia Hardy. And from Dark Star, because you have Felicia. So here's the cat ears. That's why I love wearing them because I love being a little cat, especially being a Wiccan. And as you can see, is my Wiccan star. I even have, you want to know how much of a fan I am? Look what I have. I have a Death Note, okay, necklace. Even better. You know what I can show you? Even better. I just picked this up. A lot of people might, okay, camera, can we focus on it? There it is. It's a watch. It's a pocket watch. I'm not going to say which series it is. I'd rather you guys see, figure out what series it is, but I'm going to open it up and show you it. Okay? So however you want to edit this video, however, but look what it is. Okay? Where is it? See? And then if you open it up, I can't even see. I'm having a hard time because it's very strong. Look, pocket watch. See? Isn't that cool? And then... The best part, I found this one. Look, it's also a pocket watch. Okay? You, am I a geek or am I a geek? Alright? Look at Look at this. If you can, the camera can focus in on this. Come on, camera, focus. Be good so they can see the inside of this. Look at this. Hey, look. Come on, focus on it. Let's try from back here. Maybe if we go slow in. There we go. If we go slow in, the camera will work on it. Look. Look, and you open it up, right? And inside, slow, slow, slow. Look, cool, right? Really cool, okay? And then I picked up this for my niece to be like the doctor's watch for her when she graduates. Now, I'm spoiled, the surprise. But here's even my geek gear. I go to MagiQuest. How many of you guys go to MagiQuest? Anyone want to come to MagiQuest? Especially the one in South Carolina, because I haven't been to that one. The one in Jersey is okay, but this is my wand from Magic Quest. I have the, the wise world, the owl. Mm-hmm. I mean, guys, I am a catch. You have to see when I'm in cosplay. Okay? And you know what? I got something I can show you. I got something really good to show you. If I don't, that was something crashing. Okay? Here's something I can show you. Okay, you guys are gonna love this. This is why I love dressing up. Come on. The Omnitrix. Come on, how many girls have the Omnitrix? Huh? Let's see. Look. Cool. Like I said, I got more stuff than you can think of. I dropped my Generator X gun. <laughs> That's what you heard falling. Let me see if I can get that one. See? Generator X. Alright. I mean, I even have a Hello Kitty. I got a Hello Kitty clock. I can't think of anything else to show you. I can't show you that over there. It's not finished yet. 
I'm saving it for surprise when I go to Comic Con. But like I said, my costumes or cosplay as the true anime person, I'm gonna save them surprise because I change every day. One idea I'll have that I'll tell you, you're not gonna see it. But I will try to tell you, I'm trying to be the 13th Doctor, and you know what? I'm afraid to pause this because there's no pause on this, but I do have something to show you. I made my own sonic screwdriver. Hold on. Okay, guys. This is the one I bought from the store that I've been playing with. I think I finally figured out one I want to make. Right? This is what you buy in the store. 80 pieces or 80 different designs. Right? But I made my own. And I wish I could find somebody to help me fix it so I can make it make noise and everything. But this is the coolest thing that I have. My own Sonic screwdriver. I made my own. And I like this part because if I click on that. Oh, wow. Look. Hopefully it changes the rest of the colors, but I have that. Look at the center. See? The center lights up. Click it off. All right? Let's see. There we go. Look. The center changes color. I made my own sonic screwdriver. Okay? I'm just sad it doesn't have any noise. This is the one you buy in the store. Okay? This is the one I made. Now let's put this in the background. Okay? Okay, how do we do this so we can hide it? Okay, ready? Let's make the noise of this. Do, 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 do. See, I'm not left handed. I'm ambidextrous, but I'm not really left handed. So I'm using this. Ooh, there we go. We got that sound. As that, yep. Yeah. See what I mean? So, I can use this as my sound effect in here, but I made my own sonic screwdriver. If I ain't a geek or a nerd, what else would you say? Okay? So I'm gonna. That's the only problem with it. And then I turn this off, and I store it in this so I don't lose the pieces. And it's actually in a toothbrush holder. In TARDIS blue, by the way. Okay? So. Am I geeky enough for you guys? I'm losing everything around here. I drop everything. Um, I know you're going to edit this, so please edit it very nicely. Because I hope you find me in my match. Because I broke okay, Cupid. I broke sights. Okay. So this is Felicia McTamara, Gadget, signing off. And as I used to do in DJing, I used to say, See you later from DJ Gadget, a tour through movie and TV soundtracks. If anybody knows me from a certain school that ended in 5.30 a.m. radio. Okay? And hopefully I'll be picking up my DJ career soon, but I do DJ. I do background acting. I was on Law & Order for six years. I did Law & Order Convictions. I mean, I worked with one of the guys from Haven, Eric Balfoy. I don't think he remembers me. I worked with J. August Richard. I've worked with Mariska, but it was mostly background work. I didn't get my speaking roles because life hit me. I had to get a, a job with this recession and everything. And that also hampered my, hampered my dating experiences too because there's no place to go unless you spend money. And my family is very overprotective. Even being 36, they're more because there was a situation that I don't want to mention. It was to the point where they are overprotective for a reason because this guy can lose his job. He works for the police department. <laughs> so, I don't, if you please edit that out if you have to, but he was not a very nice one, if you get my drift. Alright? He could lose a job there because technically I can say one word. Alright? So, I guess that's really it. I can't really do much because everything's in boxes still and or on the shelf or everywhere. I wanted to play some anime music, but I mean, well, there's one thing I could show you. I mean, come on, if you, how many anime fans may have this? You know, I even have the Sailor Moon one somewhere, but I have this. You know, I mean that that, I mean that's cool, right? And everything. I know I'm, do I'm getting out of camera. I know you guys want me in camera because you want to see it, see me, and everything. But things are all over the place because, like I said, I can't really show you anything. Um. I do have the Family Guy, the Star Wars series. I mean, how geeky more can you get with that? 
Um, could just, I mean, where are my tarot cards? See, I lose tarot cards because they disappear whenever they don't want to be seen because we can't use them at the time. But I'm just trying to think, what else? Um, I mean, does, I can't shut. I'm an enigma. It's, <laughs> this is just caught me off guard. So I hope you like this. And let's say it again. I'm Felicia Ann McNamara, known as Gadget. I was a DJ, background actress, and basically just looking for someone who compliments me and will let me be me. Because I'm born under Murphy's Law. Whatever can happen can happen. Whatever goes wrong can go wrong. And you'll be always on your toes. Not on Lucy Ricardo toes, but you'll always be on your toes. Because I keep things interesting. So bye for now. See you at Comic-Con 2012 at Sci-Fi Speed Dating. And hopefully, maybe you guys can fix me up with somebody that actually would, would how do I put it? Not ditch me after so because they can't stand my collection or they can't, they, okay? So, bye for now. Hope to see you soon. And I hope I answered all the questions. Fingers crossed. Have a good night. Bye.